is because, you know, it's, it's multiple reasons. Multiple, multiple, multiple fucking reasons. But I am officially now looking for a new television home. So, y'all see me on TV, but you won't see me on the network no more. <clears throat> Sitting there, so I wash my hands with a lot of shit. I've been dealing with too much, you know, so many changes going on with within, you know, working. I feel drained, tired. Like, I don't have time for none of this shit, especially to be under, you know, underpaid. So, Natalie didn't do anything. It has nothing to do with Natalie. It has nothing to do with any of the girls. Like, it has nothing to do with baddies. It has nothing to do with any show I've done. It has a lot to do with production. So, I will not be working for them anymore. Like, this is it. I feel like I gave, I gave too much. I gave too much of my time, my talent, my all. I gave too much for a motherfucker to be, you know, not giving a bitch what she needs. So it's a wrap. I've been nice too long. I've been nice way too motherfucking long. And exactly, it's called growth. I felt like, you know, when I did get on the network, I was 20 some years old. It was fun then, but now it's not fun because. Now, you know, I'm, I'm kind of starting to see what everybody else is talking about. You know, it ain't just one person saying the same shit. It's, it's multiple things that I'm tired of. So, I built a name for myself. Shit, I had one before I even got on the fucking network. Just I got a new one once I got on the damn dating show. But other than that, I will, like, I will be doing a show. But it's going to be on another network which i'm not saying which one I, it's gonna be on another network like i said i always have my options open and my backup and everything just in case and i already knew it was gonna lead down to what it led down to and i'm not arguing with nobody over what, what my work has spoke spoke for itself you know what i'm saying my work has spoke for itself throughout the years and i feel like if a person if a person puts something like an offer out on the table and the offer is just sitting on the table, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody making plans for it. Ain't nobody doing nothing. It's definitely not going to be on fucking out as TV. I, de I would never. I don't give a flying fuck how much, how much hate, if I had any hate in my heart for Zeus, I don't. But I would never work with now that's fucking TV. Like, hell no. I don't give a fuck how much money they got up over there. I, I no, no. No, 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 but yes, um, there's two other networks I was talking to, uh, major networks, and also, um, oh no, I'm good, baby. <laughs> Thank you, boo. <laughs> but, um, all right, boo. Thank you. I swear, I love my fans, they're so sweet, but, um, yeah, I definitely, um, I didn't want to do what I had to do, but I, I got to do what I got to do. You know what I'm saying? For not just, just, not just for me, but I got a kid that I got a future to worry about. I got a family. I got everything else that I got to worry about. I don't even want to start another family. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to secure my mind shit for myself. And it is what it is. It's people not moving fast enough for me. They're not moving fast enough for me. I'm not about to keep waiting. It is what it is.